welcome to my channel myself Arpita Paul and I am back again with another new video and today I will tell you how you can use Google Meet app for online classes okay so if you are using Google Meet app then first thing you need a proper internet connection so check if your uh, machine is connected with internet or not okay then along with the internet connection you need a proper valid email address also if you don't have any email address create a new one okay then after that how you will use the google meet app that i am showing you now okay so for that you have to open your web browser you and you have to log into your google account okay if you are using it in your uh, android phone then go to the play store and download the google meet app from there and install it in your phone and if you are using it in your uh, desktop or in laptop then you have to just simply log into your gmail account and within the gmail account you will get the google app options so select the google meet option from here so you, you will get the google meet option here click on the google meet option so this will lead you to a new tab you can see here two options are coming start a meeting or enter the meeting code so if you are logging in as a teacher then you have to click on the start a meeting option and if you are logging in as a student then you have to enter the meeting code here okay so let me show you first the teachers part okay so i will first show you how you can start a meeting that means the teachers end okay so for that you have to click on the option start a meeting so i am clicking on the option then it will lead you to this window okay now you can see me in the webcam okay this is my audio option and this is my video option now i have to click here to join the meeting so i am clicking on the join now option so once i have clicked in the join now option then a link is provided to me okay this link i will share with the students okay so for that i can uh, copy the joining info from here and then i can share the uh, link to the people individually by using their mail address okay so i am copying the joining info and i am sending the mail to the people so for that you will click on the add people option and here you will provide the mail address so i am providing the mail address arpita paul 2020 new at the rate gmail.com okay so this is the mail address where I am providing the invitation. So add recipient, yes. Then send mail. Okay, invitation sent. So from the teacher's end, the invitation is sent to the student. Okay, now the student will get the link and then they will join. Now you can share the link through email address or through WhatsApp or through Google Classroom or any using any other app. Okay, so if you are a student then you can only join to the class if and only if you are getting the link and you are clicking on the link okay otherwise you will not able to join the class now let me show you how you will join the class as a student you can see here i've got a mail okay so i'm clicking on the mail to open it then here it is showing arpita paul, paul is inviting you to join a video meeting happening now so i will click on the join meeting option to join the class so this will lead you to another uh, new tab so here the window will appear same way how the teachers window has come here the window will appear which will access the camera and the audio device both and then here it will uh, ask you to join the meeting okay so let it come then i will show you now here it will provide you this option ask to join so you have to click on this option ask to join by clicking on this option you are asking the teacher to accept you in their classes okay so you have to click on this ask to join and then i will show you how teacher will accept your request so i'm clicking on the ask to join option so asking to join so now in the teachers end you can see someone wants to join this meeting deny entry and admit entry so if i click on the admit option then the person who wants to join the meeting can be easily added to this class okay so i'm clicking on the admit option this is how it will look like from teachers end okay now if you 
want to share your screen then you have to click on the present now option and there if you are willing to share the whole screen then you will select on the your entire screen option or if you want to uh, share only a specific window then you have to click on the a window option okay if you are clicking on your entire screen option then the whole screen will be displayed okay now let me show you how the student will see the teacher this is how it will look like from student's end okay i hope now you can use the google meet app for online classes okay until then stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos okay and if you have any video suggestion please mention it in the comment section below like and share the video until then stay tuned thank you